and you'll live the life of victory. Hello guys, this is Shundel and today here, it is just a reminder to each and every one of us that we must have that focus. Stay in focus so you can live a life with victory. I know it is easier said than done, but I always believe that God is still on the throne. He is there for us. When you are going to call unto Him, believe in Him. He is there to each and every one of us. Guys, remember, He created us from his own image and by that there's no doubt take away the doubt he is there to give you to live that life of victory but guys always remember we have to do our part as it said in Isaiah 30 18 yet the Lord longs to be gracious to you therefore he will rise up to show you compassion blessed are all who wait for him see it says simply in the book of Isaiah blessed are all who wait for him yes we are all blessed we have to do our part when we pray we must practice the patience of waiting it is a part of our life journey to be patient, to wait into something we wanted. When we are asking for something, guys, we have to understand that waiting is a must to do. Yes, there are three kinds of answered prayer. First, he is going to say yes. Then other thing, he can say no. Then, the third thing, he wants us to wait. And during that waiting period of time, guys, we must practice and believe that he is going to rise up to show us compassion. Because as it says in the book of Isaiah, blessed are all who wait for him. We simply wait for him we have to believe that all things are going to work together for good for those who love the lord so during the waiting period of time guys simply love him trust him believe in him and obey him guys this is just really a share because this word really inspires me today. It inspires me today to be more patient, to face the fact that we are all blessed because He's going to show us compassion. And He promised, blessed are all who wait for Him. So guys, comfort yourself practice your patience you are not alone you can really make it to the end just think whatsoever you are struggling at this very moment you have to do your part to trust him to believe in him to believe in the scripture to believe in the promises he has said to us he simply said yet the Lord longs to be gracious to you therefore he will rise up to show you compassion see he is gracious to us he is going to do great things to us but we must obey, trust, and obey what is written in the scripture. Remember always, guys, that He is 
all-powerful God who longs to be gracious to us. He is the God of infinite grace who always exceeds His greatest blessings to us. With that greatest blessings, guys, you have to practice that feeling, having that greatest expectation as well, believing and declaring that when we are thirsty, He is going to bring out the greatness and put it in our heart. He is a merciful God. He is there to bless to each and every one of us. So simply trust Him, believing in the scripture that He longs to be gracious to us and He is going always show compassion to us. Practice your patience. This is Yundel. Thank you for listening. Thank you for dropping here in my channels, guys. It's late here already. It's already 10 p.m. in Norway. It's sunset now soon. And we are going to take the cable lift back down hill to our car. Guys, always think the God creation is so amazing. You are also, you are God's creation. You are amazingly great and beautiful. I love you all and bye-bye.